<clears throat> well, good evening. Balmy dizzy, 23 degrees on the screen. A crazy kind of madness. Silence in the sky. But that's for you and I. 23 degrees. They're not far off. Ooh. Ah. Right. More of this crazy twilight business. Madness, isn't it? I'll pull that apart a minute. One sec. A welder was welding the door shut of some unsafe building with 27,000 tonnes of ammonia, a nitrate, being stored next to a firework factory. But the authorities knew that it was being unsafely stored. And the world has gone to weld the door shut. Um, first of all, if you're a welder, you should know about the job entailed and what's involved. It's called a risk assessment that's carried out on every single job that could be potentially hazardous. Right? That's what's called a risk assessment. <clears throat> and being a welder, I don't think, as a welder, would put his hand to that job, so to speak, if the risk assessment came back as like, yeah, it's dodgy, but we can do it. And uh, 27,000 tonnes of ammonia nitrate, right? The safe storage of ammonia nitrate, right, is uh, is usually about 20, 25 tons, and it's got to be kept a thousand, two thousand feet away from itself. Um, oh, sorry, sorry. Google's uh, censoring some. Um, information uh, or whatever some sites or whatever they won't you know what I mean when it comes to the safety of handling of said chemical that is a fertilizer the base or strange how there was like four blasts in four different countries all at the same time all that chemical plants in it but my mind boggles But like I say, do you know what I mean? The, the, the story, their story always changes. It's dependent on how many people grip onto it and, you know. Um, still can't take my square as seriously. Clowns, not worth it. Anyway, that's for another time, right? That's what's on my mind here, so um just gonna wrap that up. I mean so obviously the narrative's gonna change on that, like you can't have a welder welding doors shut and a, 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 a what is it, like a loose spark. You what? Oh my gosh. The lengths, like, like, you just got to pull that apart straight away. I just had to. Anyway. <laughs>